good morning all of you in today's session we are going to start with the 10th standard chemistry and physics unit number 8 chemical bonding series 6 is going to be discussed earlier we completed how the chemical bonds is originated and uh, valency and also we completed how the ionic bond formation is possible now we entered into based on this ionic bond formation how the molecules we are going to demonstrate how the ionic bond formation takes place among the various molecules in addition to this one earlier we completed unit 1 to 7 entire detailed explanation available on the channel called world of competitive chemistry now let us go and discuss about series number 6 where we are going to Uh, observe the demonstration of ionic bond formation in the various molecules move on to formation of ionic bond here I explain the formation of ionic bond by taking an examples four examples were taken sodium chloride magnesium chloride sodium oxide aluminum chloride through the lewis electron dot symbol so electron dot symbol was taken and based on that through the transfer of electron from one element of metal to any other element of non metal let us go with the first example called the sodium chloride uh, table salt sodium chloride is formed up from the elements of sodium and chlorine it can be explained by taking sodium half of chlorine gives rise to sodium chloride because sodium is monovalent and we are taking the chlorine cl2 but here we require only one chlorine hence we are taking its stoichiometric ratio in the form of 1 by 2 so that the eventual product will be sodium chloride solid compound we are taking metallic sodium solid chlorine being it is a gaseous compound bonded to sodium forms a solid of sodium chloride and clearly it is distributed in this chemical equation sodium outermost electron will be transferred to chlorine so that here transfer of electron gives rise to stable configuration with the sodium by losing one electron become electropositive chlorine attain the electron become electronegative and both are uh, uh, resembling their electronic configuration noble gas which is the nearest to noble gas here sodium initially to 1s2 2s2 2p6 3s1 it will be 1s2 2 6 plus 2 3p i and now they finally converted into a completely filled octet and uh, here step by step demonstration get carried here in order to get the cation from metallic sodium to ionic sodium what we are taking we are taking sodium metal with atomic number of 11 means 11 protons are 11 electrons present in its valence shell now it is in the gaseous state element we are taking and turned into a sodium positive by losing one of the electron by loss of electron the sodium turned into a any a positive and uh, the one is to two is to two p6 near by neon configuration got attained an electron distribution diagram is also manifested here one is to two is to two p6 three is one will be the sodium metal and by losing electron a mono positive ion will be originate here that mono positive ion our generator will be uh, near by neon configuration so that it will be more stable the generated one will be more stable in nature now move on to how the chloride formation is possible from neutral chlorine and ion origination for that purpose we are taking chlorine and its electronic configuration will be 1s2 2s2 2p6 3s2 3p5 so while seeing our uh, losing electron always there is a short of electron that's the reason why gain the electron and used to give the nr by organ configuration by forming uni negative charge being chlorine is atomic number 17 and a gaseous compound and having strong tendency to seek the electron and turned into a chlorine minus because the electron count will be 18 proton count will be 17 so that there is a one negative cl minus with the gaseous state is indicated and their corresponding electronic configurations are manifested uh, for chlorine 1s2 2s2 2p6 3s5 when we turn into chloride that is completely 
uh, completely filled organic configuration called one two rupees. 